All right, everybody, in the glass today is the Jacasson Cuvée 744 Extra Brut, based around the 2016 vintage. Now, one of the things I have always enjoyed about Jacasson, and it could very well be my favorite small house, uh, is that they have a almost Burgundian sense to them. There, there is a good presence, there is a good weight and texture on these champagnes. At the same time, there's some really nice kind of brightness and acid and, and tautness uh, to it overall. Now, my understanding is the 744, again, based around 2016 with reserve, uh, is 45% Chardonnay, about 35% Pinot Noir, and about 20% Pinot Meunier uh, in Cepage. Jacasson, the, or the Chiquet, Chiquet family doing Jacasson, has been doing an increased amount of oak barrel fermentation. Uh, and as a result, I think you do kind of get that texture, that weight, that presence to these wonderful champagnes. Let's give them a try. Man, in the nose, you get that really nice kind of lemon and citrus oils. There's, there's also some really nice kind of um, white flush stone fruits, a little bit of like a, a floral note, uh, as well as some really nice kind of almost a, um, just a touch of, of a savory edge herbal element coming through. On the palate, this has really good acidity. Uh, at the same time, there, there's a nice presence and a weight and texture to the shape. To the champagne. Uh, it is one that I think would go better with food than by itself, uh, but it is one of those where as uh, tasting this after having not had it for about six months, it has put on considerable weight and also add some nice brioche notes. Uh, so I think that this with a pretty minimal dosage of 0.75 grams per liter um, is destined to give you the most joy if you bring it to the table. I think this is delightful champagne. I'm enjoying it. I hope you do too. Cheers, stay safe, and be well.